What did you make of this decision by San Francisco to retain Jimmy Garoppolo, have him on the roster in the QB room for 2022? Well, what we heard the entire offseason was how the 49ers were trying to shop Jimmy G the entire time. But they weren't hearing back great offers in return. So what do they do? They take a look at his contract. They re-sign him. They re construction the deal right they take a look at the deal they make it a little bit better and the fact that they can still move him i know there's a new new, a no trade clause but at the same time that gives jimmy g a little bit of an edge of where he wants to go because in 2023 he'll be able to choose that as well now it doesn't mean he's going to be there for the whole entire season as you know it gives them about two more months before the trade deadline and they could actually move him before then so i think it's kind of a win-win situation for jimmy Jimmy G and the 49ers because Trey Lance, as you know, he is an unproven quarterback. And that's the thing about it. Now you have a guy that is a very good backup. You could argue that Jimmy G could possibly be the best backup in the entire league right now. So if Trey Lance struggles, you could put Jimmy G in there because the locker room loves him. So I think it's a win-win, but not so much for Trey Lance because in his mind, if he has a stretch where he goes three games that's bad they could put jimmy g as right. a starter in for there but i i mean if you look at it it's good for jimmy g it's good for the 49ers but for trey lance of course uh i'd be a little bit worried but it'll be see it'll be kind of cool to see how mentally tough he is through this time